she's so DIY, you know, you get it. She don't believe in uh, saloon or na- nation. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, Who when, told you that? when they are paying twenty five thousand to put fake nail on your oh, finger, she's like, no, God, God forbid, uh, uh, no, not this. Me. I'm not allowed to roll. Please, no. <laughs> I go paint on myself. <laughs> I have a Nini Ola in the studio, people. Yeah. Yay. I've been dying to ask her. You know, when you started out, mm-hmm. it was just you and your sound. You were just different. You were mm-hmm. giving it to us back to back. But now, every song seems to have that house element, mm-hmm. that dance element, that I'm a piano element. Mm-hmm. And um, this is your main thing. This is mm-hmm. this is you. Mm-hmm. Like, you've always been this person. How does that make you feel? One, two, how are you still trying to still give us the vibe and be mm-hmm. different? Because this song, yeah, is very different. Mm-hmm. And I wonder if that was hard to achieve. Okay, so Afro House, I love Afro House. It's a fusion of um, anything African in terms of the language mm-hmm. and the beat, fusion with house music. Now, house music is under EDM. Mm-hmm. And then Afro House is a sub- subgenre of house music. So it's very wide. Mm-hmm. So I can jump from one subgenre to the other. Because the sound sounds, I mean, the sound is similar. Mm-hmm. So when people say, oh, Nina has been doing I'm a, I'm a piano since, not necessarily, mm-hmm. no. But I've been doing house music. Mm-hmm. And now the music is, everybody wants to jump on it. And I'm like, okay, cool. Mm-hmm. You know, but the way Nina will do it be different. And everybody is unique in their own way. But I'm still, you know, loving the music. And it's very hard to find producers that can, you know, give me the beats, the kind of production that I want. But I'm still, I'm loving it and I'm happy that, you know, um, people are jumping on it and loving it and people are dancing in the clubs at home yeah. and everywhere. Yeah. How long do you think it's going to last? Um, I don't know because <laughs> um, I'm just happy that people are dancing again. Mm-hmm. Because for some years, people were just, you know, nodding in the club and, you know, but now people are dancing and they're happy. And so whether it lasts or not, Niniola's music will always last. So it's not about the trend for me. It's about me being true to myself and being able to communicate with people and just make people dance and laugh and, you know, and just ha- be merry. And, and have a good time. Yeah. This song, who, who this song is called Want. Yeah. Who's produced this one now? Smeez and Dean. Okay. They're the, from abroad. And Nigerians. Nigerian. Okay. Yeah. The name is, I thought it would be <laughs> Chukudi and Chukudi. <laughs> But Smeez and Dean. Yeah. Ah, Super pop. talented guys. Super yeah. Super talented. How did you find them? Okay, so um, I'm always sourcing for beats. Because like I said earlier, it's hard to get, you know, to yeah. impress me, mm-hmm. so to say. And then Michael, you know, told me, he called me up one day and was like, Ah, Nini, these guys who Smeez and these guys are really cool. I'm like, okay, let me hear what they have. And before I hear any beat, Michael, like, listens to the beats and just you know make sure that he knows what i like anyways Mm -hmm. and when i heard some of the beats i'm like okay i'm sure they can do something and then i had like a music camp and Mm. they came over and we walked on you know music together and that's how it came about and how did you decide that this song was going to be a single so when i heard the beats it always starts from the Mm beats if the beat is slow and sleepy ah (laughs) (laughs) but if i'm moving in the studio and i'm vibing and dancing i know yes this is it and also michael michael is my a and r it's like oh nini you're liking it i knew you like it so and then i heard the beat i dropped the vibes and everything i'm like ah that be big. This is it, mm-hmm. you know. And everyone in the studio was like, "Okay, yeah, my sound engineer, AQs, and Michael were like, okay, seems like this is the one. Yeah, this is it. Yeah." How did you do it? How did do you pray at night so that your voice will remain so judish? Okay, so I always pray to God. Uh-huh. For inspiration, always. Hmm. Oh, good. <laughs> Debbie, are you serious? I'm very. I'm learning a you lot. You don't want me to pray to God again. I do. Uh-huh. So I just want you to help me write your prayer point so that I can, <laughs> I can apply the same prayer point. After all, Sierra's yeah. prayer is on a track. The whole of the prayer that Sierra used to find out was Bando. Eh. Uh-uh. Oh God, Nini, I don't like this. I will play you the track. Okay. So you can you can write it down. You can use it. And but this girl, she did this guy. Because as she is now, God knows whether she have seven twins somewhere. Who? With you. Oh, yes. I thought you were still talking about Sierra. 
Nini never gets in trouble. So no. it's always why? Is it that you you intentionally try and stay away from drama? Like you have had zero issues. Mm-hmm. How is that possible? Because I just focus on the music. I just want people to listen to the music and that is all. My private life is very private. Yeah. That's it. And I mean that's fantastic. So when you think of Niniola, the only thing that comes to mind is the music. Yeah, it's like yeah. ah sorry again, you know, nice. <laughs> what she dating we don't know is she wedded she can have seven children as she is now I swear nobody will know and you will not know and I suspect because she just disappeared <laughs> she just disappeared she just give us one you video you people here. will not know one video here she will not even do uh, nothing nothing just dance to the music that's all before you go I want you to tell me what's next is one part of an album oh don't do this <laughs> Because that's all I want. I just want like 20 just months. Want. So that I can just be dancing. Me, need a Silosi Club because it's expensive. You get it? But if I have an album with I just saw that video where they point something in your mouth to. That was wedding. Wedding is free of charge. Just ah. like. <laughs> <laughs> Every of charge now. Don't do this to me. Okay, uh-huh. so once definitely um is a new single that just dropped today, so I'm excited. Yeah. Yes. You can see she's into 419. <laughs> I'm excited and of course I'm working on a project. So um let's carry this one first. Once. Hmm. That means that the album. So if you really want the album, you carry this one. Carry the song once. 